hello everyone in this video i am going to show you how to create seamless repeat pattern in the app high paint using clipboards so here i am opening uh, canvas you can use either one is to one ratio canvas otherwise you can custom create your canvas here i am using uh, 2000 cross 2000 pixel uh, so if you want to create your own canvas size just click custom and uh, enter the value here I'm using 2000 pixel range and make sure you uh, select PP as 300 and keep that as pixel range and yeah now we have created a custom canvas and here I'm not going to draw anything in any layer so you can see like here i don't have any uh, drawings uh, i'm not going to draw anything instead i'm going to use clipboard clipboards are the small art works which are in the png format so here i am going to import using um, this picture option just click on the plus symbol and go to pictures and select album and go to the album where you have the clipboards so this is the clipboard it is the animal clipboard i have brought uh, brought recently um, from etsy so click the select the clipboard that you want to import and release this transform tool once you placed it somewhere now again just import whatever clipboards you're going to use so as i mentioned before clipboards are the can uh, you know artwork or elements for the patterns which are created in the png format so uh, if you want to create your own clipboard just draw um, in a separate uh, canvas and save that as without background without any color or white background and make sure you save that as png and that's how we will get this clip art and then import that here so that's the best way to create a repeat pattern uh, uh, creating or uh, drawing on the same canvas then creating a clipping uh, i mean a repeat pattern is difficult because it makes use of so many layers and uh, with so many layers the app start to um, you know lag so uh, it's better to draw separately and clip, uh, save that as clip art and then import this now what i'm going to do is i'm going to use these elements and i'm going to create a group Put all the um, clip parts inside this group by dragging. Here you can see this picture is somewhat uh, inner compared to other layers, which means that is under the group. So just drag and put inside this group. Now this is only for our reference. So drag and copy. So now. We don't need this group it's only for our purpose like if you want any element you can go back and duplicate and here in this group we have these um, elements or clip parts now I'm just copied or duplicated all those four elements and I'm going to use one by one now I will show you how to do this when you are moving any clipboard make sure you you know switch off the visibility of the copy so that you know you don't need to get confused which um, layer I am in so now I am placing this floor and now I am just moving this floor to the bottom and I'm going to move here so make sure you switch off the visibility of the other copied clipboard now 
just move and place wherever you want so in this way of repeat pattern um, there is no something called a tile or um, you know making or placing them at the corner positioning all those things not going to happen here so uh, if you have seen any procreate kind of uh, repeat pattern tutorial or infinite painter tutorial then that will not work here because the way of creating repeating pattern in that app is totally uh, different from here because when it comes to procreate or infinite painter uh, at the end we can create a separate tile save that in our gallery and we can use that tile uh, 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 you know if you want to upload in red bubble simply save the tile and use that but uh, uh, here there is no option for creating tile uh, in both ibs paint text and high paint don't have that tile option so whatever we're going to do whatever placing uh, distance um, you know calculating all those things happens in this canvas itself and at the end we're going to merge all the layer to the single one and we're going to uh, apply the tiling tool and also uh, when it comes to ibs plain text we can keep that as a group itself by clicking on that entire group and then using the repeat option we can create the repeated pattern but uh, we don't need to merge the layers in high ibs paint x but when it comes to high paint so here we don't have any option to repeat all the layers at once so whatever we are going to position you have to make sure you do everything here itself in this step itself once you done everything all those positioning we going to merge all the layers into a single layer and then we are going to make the repeating process so you cannot um, uh, no, add any further details or elements once you completed creating the repeat pattern so that's the thing about this so whatever positioning you have to do here so that's why you can see i'm doing very slow and checking whether it looks good here or good there or the size is perfect or i have to change the size position angle all those things i'm checking and doing one by one and here you can see i'm using the flipping option sometime i use uh, you know change in the angle to make the same element look different here you can see I have used um, same uh, honeybee but it looks somewhat different from one another because uh, I just changed the angle or uh, flipped it horizontally and so that's how it we make it look like we have you know more elements so actually we have only four elements but we making it to look like we have so many elements with different characters so that's mainly because of the angle and size so that's also matters and here you can see I'm almost going to finish this positioning process so the tutorial is mainly about the technique uh, in which way we can create such a, a beautiful repeat pattern with basic tools we have in high paint there are many um, people who don't like infinite painter and they like high paint in such case it i don't uh, push you to create repeat pattern in infinite painter however infinite painter is the best for me but you can also create such a uh, thing in repeat pattern in high paint so that's what i'm going to share with you here so now 
I almost created the elements and we have so many layers here now if I click on any layer and I try to repeat using the tiling option it is possible but when I go to this layer I mean group and if you click the tiling option it will not happen because it can only create repeating pattern for single layer so just call duplicate the group entire group like this and hide one copy I mean one group and we're going to work on this group at the top now click on this group option you will get the so many options in that you will get merge group layers or merge layer groups uh, uh, layers in the group so click on that and instantly it became a single layer with all the elements in it now I'm going to use this layer for creating the repeat pattern so beyond that layer click on the tiling tool and there is three option you can check each option uh, click on this adjust the horizontal vertical spacing and the offset like this and check what works for you and make sure the tile here you can see that one square that we have created already is a tile here and make sure it didn't collide with another copy uh, which is repeated nearby uh, it will look uh, you know messy avoid that make sure you have enough space between the elements though so that didn't um, hide with you know hide or collide with each other also if you want to make it small uh, big pattern with so many small elements just adjust the anchor point make it uh, make it smaller just by dragging like this and you can see when I decrease the value it actually merge it with one another so avoid that so you can try all these three um, tiling options and check which one works for your pattern now click on the stick and your pattern is ready and for saving these uh, repeat pattern there are three ways so here I don't have any particular background details it's just a white background color that already present in the canvas so if you want to save if you want to save this just you can see here this is the empty layer actually and in background we have the white color that's what here and now go to this share and click on this jpg and this is how it looks so the pattern came out really well now if you want to change the background color click on this background and choose any color you can actually drag all the colors and see, uh, you know see which color suits for your pattern and this color looks good and now I'm going to save this as JP JPG again and this is the first pattern we have created and this is the second one with the background color now if you want this to be a transparent background then what you have to do is go to these layers and switch off the background so that you have this transparent um, you know background and then save this as png instead of jpg so click on this png and here is the png repeat pattern so the background is actually empty you can add any color background for that so yeah this is the first one and i hope you like the technique how to make repeat pattern using this high paint and i just made the video really slow so that you can understand better hope you like this if so subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching bye